I respect them. They're great players. I mean, they're they're definitely not. They're not like the only people in the world that probably had the fucking thought to throw a match. You know, like back then. I'm sure a lot of fucking teams had that thought because no one knew the consequences. <laughs> Obviously, at this junction in CS:GO, no one is gonna fucking throw a match. Like the, you would literally have to be that shit crazy. You'd have to have five people that were like, "All right, we're fucking. This is our last match ever. Like, let's just keep doing this until we retire." Because <laughs> no one would do that now. But back then, I guarantee that they there were a lot of teams that got away with it. And there were a lot of teams that even that thought about it if they didn't, like, get away with it, you know? I just guarantee it. There's, like, think about it. These teams weren't getting paid salary back then. Like, and it's, I don't know, it's just, why wouldn't you think about it, right? Like, like if, if you're, like, a sketchy person, then you're going to think about that kind of stuff. Like, not everyone on the internet is fucking the nicest person ever to... That's how I feel about it, and it just sucks that some of the best players in North America got caught throwing a match, and I agree there definitely should be a punishment for it, 100%. Like, I don't know what that punishment is, um, and maybe it should be forever. Like, I don't, I don't know, but, like, at the same time, it, it's just, it does suck, you know? Like, I can, I can feel for them, even if it is, like, a really shitty thing that they did, so...